Alright guys, somebody commented this and I'm going to create this video for him. If you guys have any other ideas to contribute to me, write in the comment section below and I'll see if I can create a video on this. Alright guys, so if you have followed my previous videos, mapping network drive folder into your Ubuntu server next cloud so that you can copy your files or folder from Windows directly inside the account right so this is my administration account you go into photos you can see all of these photos here so here is also the same inside the website also we'll see the photos okay so now if I'm going to show you how to synchronize anything that you have copied inside your shared file to Ubuntu. So if I were to copy this and if I were to copy this inside data administration videos. So if I copy one here, okay. So now if I refresh in Nextcloud website, nothing happens, correct? So what you need to do is, okay, so go into your Ubuntu server. Now put in this code and it will scan all your users this is one of the step there are another two step if this doesn't work so now if i check inside and refresh you will see the extra photos for clone trooper and the mac os wallpaper so if i will were to if i were to open it you see the wallpaper of Mac OS Mountain and now if I go into the videos <laughs> alright so you see this works so this is how you synchronize your database when you insert files folder from Windows in your shared file a shared folder okay to your ubuntu server if this doesn't work you will need to go into this mc this is a gui for file explorer in ubuntu server go all the way back into this now you'll see media mnt if you have followed my previous video, you will have created a map drive of Windows in either one of these. Mine is in MNT and you can see this is the WinShare and you can see my Nextcloud data are all here. Okay. So that so this is my Windows Mac drive in Ubuntu server. Over here slash var is where your next cloud snap is. So you go to slash var, go into the snap, and then you'll see next cloud here. Then you can choose either this with numbers or the current both of these you can see in the next cloud config you'll see config.php if you go back and you see 28586 maybe your number may vary then you go into next cloud config and you'll see config.php both are the same php follow the the folder path and insert in the code and try it out 
so now what you need to do is cd then to the path i said slash var slash snap next cloud your number slash next cloud slash config and then you scan it okay so if it works then you can skip this if it doesn't work then you can do it like this so if that doesn't work then you do this you see the the path until current instead of the number and then slash next cloud slash config and that's it and you scan again and that's it please like subscribe and comment below is my previous videos to the center is my other videos and to the side of it is my playlist for different topics in different playlists you can check that out for my previous and future videos that is to come so thank you for watching famous cyber Ramos, signing out